Hey guys, welcome to my video. Today I am trying the new Arnott's flavors of chocolate. Um, we have ginger nut, iced vovo, scotch finger, and jacks. Uh, so I'm really excited for this. I just saw them in the shops the other day and I was like, oh yes, I can definitely do a video on that. Um, hang on, I think I can hear my mom home, so I'm just going to call her in and see if she wants to try them with me because she loves chocolate, so I feel like she'll definitely want to do this. Mom? Yes. Yes. Do you want to be in my video? Your video? Yeah. Okay, what's your video about? Um, I'm trying chocolate. Oh, I do love a bit of chocolate. Do you want to be in the video? Well, I guess I could. Okay. Hang on, guys. <laughs> my mom's going to be in the video. Okay, so I've got my mum squished in the corner <laughs> of my bed because we're going to make this work. Um, she has so kindly agreed to try some chocolate with me. Um, I do love chocolate. It wasn't a hard sell. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to start off with the Jats brand. Um, I think all of these are like, are they Australian brands? Yeah, all Arnott's. All Arnott's, yes. Yeah. Australian, yes. Okay, so if you aren't from Australia, Jats is just like a savoury cracker that you'd have at like a picnic, kind of a little bit salty. It's just like a biscuit. Have it with cheese yeah, or, have it with, or something. Yeah, okay, so I think it'll be pretty plain. Taste. That is delicious. Can you taste the Jats? It's more that, yeah, it definitely has that little saltiness. It's not overly salty, but just that hint of savoury, something savoury. I just love the chocolate. Like, mm. if it had, like, nothing in it, I'm just, like, mm. loving chocolate. Mm. I think... Texture's interesting. It does taste really good. <laughs> um, I think if you like, um, kind of, like, salted caramel or that mix of sweet and salty together... It has that kind of saltiness, so I really mm. like that. And it mm. kind of just like, you know when you don't feel like eating plain chocolate, you want something with like a bit of crunch, but you don't necessarily feel like a specific flavour? Kind of just gives it like a bit of crunchiness. Mm. Yeah, and it just takes that sweetness off it. Alright, well we should have done the scotch finger first. Mm. But anyway, oh yeah, so scotch finger. I don't even know how to describe that. I wouldn't buy scotch finger as biscuits. So scotch finger is like a shortbread. Oh, okay. So it's a shortbread, so it's a sweet... It's a shortbread, so I'm expecting this to be more sweet. Yeah, there you go. Quite sweet. Okay. And looks like there's a good amount of shortbread in it. Mum, you're such a natural at this video thing. <laughs> mm. Mm. <laughs> That's yum. Definitely different to the oh. Jats because it hasn't got that Actually, saltiness. Actually, you know what? Now that you said shortbread, mm -hmm. this tastes so creamy. Mm. Like this tastes like shortbread, mm. like that butteriness of shortbread. Mm. It is. It does does have that shortbready sort of texture to it. This is the smoothest chocolate. Like this tastes like it was made in Belgium or something. Mm. Mm. You'd that's never, good. I'd never in a million years pick that. That's a Scotch finger flavored no, chocolate. That's just what I was. But it say. tastes so creamy. Mm. It's very nice, but. Once again, I wouldn't have been able to pick that if you didn't tell me what it was. It's sort of like the Jats, how it just has that crunchiness, but without the saltiness. Yeah. It's just like, mm. oh, yeah, it almost tastes nice. like the most buttery texture. Mm. I really like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, which one do you want to go next? Let's try the ginger nut. Okay, guys, okay. I am excited to try this because ginger nuts are like the biscuit that I ate my entire childhood. <laughs> like, <laughs> mum loves ginger nuts and like the whole family loved ginger nuts. Our family, like, we never had treats in the cupboard. We, like, you know, we barely oh, ever had... <laughs> we barely ever had yummy things in our lunchbox or, you know, obviously, like, mum's home cooking was good. <laughs> no, but we always have, like, a sandwich and a banana or something. Like, we never had treats. We never had treats in the cupboard, but we always had ginger nut biscuits. Like, that was, like, the one thing we had. So if, like, friends came over... I remember my friend would always be like, oh, are we having ginger nut biscuits? I'm like, yeah, like that's <laughs> that's all we had. So I'm really excited to try this. Oh, it's dark. That's good. I like dark. I don't I was I was expecting this to be milk as well. I feel like I'm not gonna like it now. Alright. You mum likes dark, so you yeah. probably will like this. Oh, I'm disappointed. Yeah. Mmm. Definitely much more crunchy. That is Definitely very tasty ginger. ginger. Mm. Mm, I like that. I don't know. I feel like I didn't think that I'd like it. 
and I was right. <laughs> mm. Definitely taste the ginger nut in it. Too much. I reckon it tastes too gingery. It's not like the dark chocolate that's putting me off, because mm. I don't really like dark chocolate, but it's almost the ginger. Mm. I like that. No, I like that, because I love ginger nut. Which is why I bought I know, one. but I, it feels like it's not just the biscuit. It's almost like they've put ginger flavour in the chocolate. Mm, maybe they did. I don't like that. You can have mm. the rest of that block. Okay. Win for me. Yep. No, I'm it. glad we had that flavour because now I can get it out of my mouth. It's oh. ice very, very cool thing. Okay, guys. Iced Vovo. These biscuits are an Australian classic. They're like iconic every, Australian. Every Australian would know what an Iced Vovo is. And my next door neighbour, the old man that used to live next door, oh, still lives next door, when I was a kid, he always had Iced Vovos, and that's like the only time I had them. So that's what I remember them by. I'll show you the picture. They're like, um, is it a shortbread biscuit or is it just it's like a biscuit a, base? Just a basic biscuit. Marshmallow, raspberry jam. It's got um, like marshmallow down the side, kind of like a strawberry flavored marshmallow, and then it has jam down the middle and then coconut on top. Like it's a very distinct flavor. Keen to try this one. Irresistible milk chocolate blended with mm. crunchy biscuit pieces, mm. coconut and raspberry flavored jelly. Now so that you would know just by taking a mouthful of it. That was ice vovo. That if taste, I was blindfolded. That tastes exactly like, like ice vovo. vovo. I would know that just from yep. the taste. You know, if I was blindfolded and you put that in my mouth, I wouldn't even like say it's ice vovo chocolate. It literally just tastes mm, like an ice, ice vovo biscuit. Mm -hmm. Like it tastes yep. exactly like it. Yeah. That tastes just like an ice vovo. It does. I but think it's, it's very like, sweet. I probably it is very prefer sweet. the dark chocolate because it's not as sweet. Got a little bit of crunch. It has. I think um. I oh, think it's, it's definitely like the, got the coconut in the it. The jellies too. in it. Um, mm. I think that gives like the flavour of like mm. that exact jelly that's on the biscuit. A little biscuit. bit of raspberry. It's very sweet though. Like I'm not um, really a lolly person, so I'm more like a chocolate person. So for me, this tastes almost too much like a lolly. Like it's very sweet. Whereas my brother loves lollies. Mm. He'd devour that whole yeah, block, no problem. Oh, you can give him the ice flavour, and I'll have the ginger yeah. nut. So is the ginger nut your favourite? think so. I'd go, if I was to rate them for me personally, mm -hmm. I'd probably go Ginger Nut, Jats, and then maybe, um, yeah, maybe Scotch Finger and then Ice Vovo. Yep. Even though Ice Vovo, if you're talking about the flavour, Ice Vovo is definitely the winner as it's the, the flavour. It's the one that tastes the most... most like the biscuit. Yeah, it tastes exactly like what it's supposed yes. to taste like. Yes. Whereas the others um, yep. are just nice. Like, I don't know. I would put Jats and I and um, Scotch Finger right up there as my favourite because I love more savoury things. So I feel like the Jats has the saltiness. But since you said that Scotch Finger is shortbread, shortbread it literally tastes so creamy and so smooth. So that's my favourite. Mm -hmm. Then the ice of over, and I wouldn't even have more ginger nut. Like I don't even like it. Okay, well, I'm it's kind of a flavour I want to get out of my mouth. You know, I like um, the ginger. I can't even eat like a whole piece of chocolate. Like these are my little discarded bits. But um. Yeah, mm. I think. Oh, that's ginger nut again. <laughs> no, I really don't like the ginger nut at all. So you can have that yeah. flavour. Oh, oh, you can have that bit. You know. All right. <laughs> Um, I think that's everything. So okay. thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I had a lot of fun filming this video, as you can probably imagine. Um, eating chocolate is not a chore. Thank you so much, Mum, for being a part oh, of it. So for you. So kind of you. I hope you liked the video. If you did, I'd love you to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And it'll give me an excuse to create more videos based on tasting food, which I'd be happy to do. <laughs> um, my next video coming up is tasting American candy and snacks, which I'm really excited for. I've already bought like a heap of snacks um, and I'm just waiting to make the video. So if you like this, definitely wait for that one.